the first matter of business is, will the SWAT meet be open because it rained last night? Stay tuned. The SWAT meet is open. And the goal today, the checklist, the first to get these wins, and that would be Sega Genesis game, a horror VHS, and a Simpsons item. But until then, let's go hunt. And yes, my hair is crazy again. I'm letting it go. Yo, Ricky, sick grind, bro, epic. <laughs> Here we go, Ricky, look at it, bro. We got Garfield Puzzle, Ricky, and Alice. Ricky's walking, he's going, he's going the distance, and we got Alvin. Ricky, I saw it, I know. Oh. Wow, Ricky, Ricky raced around me and acted like I didn't see it. <laughs> That's okay, Ricky, look at this, though. Alvin, Alvin, Alvin Door. He is. Wait, what's in the back? He, he's got a lot of junk in that trunk, look at I'll that. tell you that. <gasps> he's a pocket Alvin. I like it. Look at that comic from below you, bro. I'm looking at this comic too right there. Oh, I love these. They're so pretty. Oh, what is this? Wait, what is this too? Behind it, look, ready? There's something else back here. There's so, see, it's just like, oh my gosh. It's so beautiful. Goofy on a skateboard is quite possibly the coolest thing I've seen in a while, though, to be honest. Ricky, I just looked over and there's that. What is it? Oh, oh my. Marlboro. What is it, guys? You know I collect my Marlboro, and I don't smoke. A reminder. It is a happy bottle birthday opener. bottle opener. Great news. I don't drink either. Oh, but also, check this out. I wanted to show you guys this. They have So there's obviously a whole bunch of Mickey Mouse stuff here. Super cool. But the branding on this old Mickey Mouse stuff, man, is just so cool. I like that. It's such a cool artwork, man. I miss the good old days of Disney, you know, when they were just cranking nothing but heat. But this is sick, too. Ricky and I saw this. This old newspaper, I would frame this up. Look at this person, collector. She's an OG collector. She would have a good YouTube channel if she was around back then. Roscoe showed up. Oh, you got that already? Yes. How much was that? I paid 20 bucks. Oh, okay. it's yeah. still super it's cool, so dude. Though. Oh my gosh, yeah. make it a oh. Mac tonight. Does this fit you? Is this your size? It is my size. I was gonna say, I'll buy it off you for 20 bucks. It's so cool, I love it. You sure you don't wanna sell it? I mean, maybe. Ricky bought something. Man, I wish we would've said Nintendo Power was on the list. I think originally we did, but we lost. This we wasn't in the challenge, Ricky, so you did a good job, but it's not in the challenge, so I don't really care. Just kidding, awesome, Ricky. This is actually really cool. Hey, Arnold hat. I like it. Buy Nickelodeon. Let's go. Next booth got a box. Oh, games. I picked up that hat just for a dollar at the last booth, by the way. Uh, I guess I'll start going through these. It's kind of rummagey, curmudgeon-y in here. But, uh, you know, nothing a good dig can't fix. There's also some other games over here, but they're in a case. So I'll check in a minute. Just digging through all these game informers, and Ricky found a Zelda one, some Matrix Mad TV ones, Spider-Man. Oh, Final Fantasy right there too, Ricky. Nice, you have to keep digging. I'm sure you're about to, you're bound to come up on some really cool stuff because there's just yeah, so many in here. You could dig for hours. Like Ricky, White Line Willy. What is this? I got all these for $50 hairs. I got Mario Party 7, Mario Party DS, Mario Sports, and Mario Hoops. By the way, some debatably might say this is the greatest Mario cover of all time. You got Mario freaking getting maybe la debatably laid up by Peach with Luigi in the back mad and Danky just going for that friggin' block. The challenge today, by the way, oh, Roscoe, we should have yeah. told you, is one Simpsons item, okay. one horror VHS, and one uh, Sega Genesis video game. Wow, you're uh, you're really dialing it up there. Thank you. How much for these guys? Eighty bucks. Is that is that a bootleg Dragon Ball or something? I think it's real. El Ristiki Rito Rito Tico. What now, Genesis? That's not a Genesis game. That's an Odyssey, baby. You got some Odyssey. What the, look at that, all that Odyssey stuff. Dude, oh, look interesting. At look at so the beautiful. Balls. Wow. How much did you ask him yet? Not yet. Good old Ricky. Find out. Ten, Ten bucks each, bucks bro. Each. Pretty cool. Oh, and then that was easy. Two minutes later, he said he would do five bucks each. So I got all these. Look at the Mickey Mouse disco. Oh, okay. Okay, Ricky. Look at this phone. Look at this phone, my guy. Bro, that is so sick. How much is this guy? How much is this guy? 20 bucks. I might I might have to pull you up on that, bro, straight up. I honestly don't think I'm going to think on this. <laughs> oh, it's so cool. I think I'm going to pull the trigger for, for 20 bucks. I don't know if other people like this as much as me, but I think this stuff is super cool. Look at Disney Family Picnic. Oh, I love the Doobie Brothers, dude. I was going to do 50 on it. Wow, that is sick. So that's Ross and Doobie Brothers, bro. Oh my gosh. It's sick. A single two? Yeah. <laughs>
Oh my goodness, but yes, the Disney family pick. Just so interesting and random. Also some Gumby stuff. Look at this, Gumby bubble bath. You wanna take a bubble bath with Gumby? This freaking Aristocrats VHS. I've never seen it like that. So sick. So your face is great. Hold on. Wow, dude. Look at the back, too. Disco fever going on back there. Yeah, that's amazing. Oh, dude, right there. Gotta show how thirsty Miss Piggy is for Kermit right there. Yeah. She is just lingering hard over thoughts of Kermit. One of our homies who watches the show just showed up. He doesn't necessarily want to be on camera and brought this over and told me it cleans Sharpie really well. Oh, you got a Simpsons item? Oh, one down. All right, all right, I see you, Ricky. So Ricky did get his first Simpsons item, but let's see what it is. Oh, dude, it's like a whole little kid kit. That is so cool, Ricky. How much you get it for, though, if you don't mind Ten asking? Bucks. Ten bucks. That is sick, though. And now you are one step closer. All you need is a horror VHS, and you need a Genesis game. Ricky, it's for you. Bueno. Yeah. Uh -huh. No, it's disgusting. What'd they say? You don't want to know. Oh, good by you. <laughs> oh no! So I did buy the vintage, I think it's called like Little Jolly Green Giant or Mini. I can't remember what it is, but these actually are like 40 to 50 bucks, but I was completely sold on the look of it. This is one of those things you just gotta put in the back shelf to look beautiful. Jolly Green Giant, you know, isn't one of those things I expected to get a little nostalgia love for today, but uh, when I saw it, I got it. So it got me. It bit me with the bug. Ricky's been needing this. That's where I got you, bro. Oh, dude, oh, it's a green card still. You don't see the Noid too often lying around, but you got the Noid, you got Pink Panther, you got Kermie, you got Teletubbies, Simpsons, and, and this one's sick right here. Ooh, I'd have to cop this boy. So I did just buy that Fred Flintstone for five dollars. You know he has the game Rumbly Tumbly Adventure, so that's it. That's it right there. You would like that, Caleb. You should buy it for him. He collects Winnie the Pooh. Caleb, you collect Winnie the Pooh? He does. You he didn't know this? that? Wow, he's never watched your videos. No way. Oh my goodness. Ricky, this is a Bible Man figure. This is freaking Bible Man. And the Sword of the Spirit. So I'm just poking around at some Halo figures. There's a whole bunch down here. Halo, look at that score. But then also Bible Man. I mean, Bible Man's cool. All right, so I picked up all of these right here. Check it out, come down here. So, picked up a ton of Halo figures. Well, how many did I pick up, Ricky? Like 20 of them? But yes. the big sneak of all of this is that they did let me throw this in so I officially have a Simpsons item. So I'll need a Genesis game and a horror VHS. But Ricky, check it out. I mean, I know I got all those Halo stuff, even more in there. I got a set of Bible Man figures right there, bro. Dare I say, I think there's somewhere in the Bible that says you're not a Christian if you don't actually buy these. So that's just in that one book. So Ricky did buy, you bought the Wiimote. I bought the Wiimote. Nice. But basically what I realized is I bought 20 of those Halo figures, maybe even like one more, for 40 bucks. It's kind of like two bucks each. That's a really good deal. All right, Ricky just pulled out a, a stack of games. Ricky, what you pulling out, bro? Uh, so oh boy, paper, paper, paper Good game. Bugs Life, Medium, Harry Potter, Medium. Frogger. Good. Pocket, Pocket Bowling's Bowling. actually really fun. Monster Truck. Dude, you can get E.T. to go with your E.T. toys. Look at this, I know, look at this swap meet. This, we roll up and they have a ton of cool stuff here. So much video game stuff everywhere at every corner. Oh my. <laughs> that is awesome though, dude. Like straight up awesome. Look at me, you actually look cool for once in your life, Ricky. How do you feel about that? Let me put the beanie on real quick. Uh, wow, hipster Zed. All right, Ricky, we asked a minute ago and this wasn't for sale. And then I see Ricky tear it down. What the freak, bro? How'd you convince him? I didn't, I just, he's like, you want it? I'm like, yeah. What? <laughs> what, how much? How much? What'd you say? Five? Oh my gosh, you son of a gun, Ricky. It's cloth. Well, that's Ricky, that's actually really thick. The borders on them have heavy plastic. Nice job, Ricky. So if you might have noticed, Ricky was a little awkward during that. Apparently it's because one of the other guys didn't want to sell it, but the guy that was in charge did want to sell it. And I'm over there like, hey, is everything is this for sale? <laughs> Ricky bought it, yeah. I win everything. It's one of those writing pads, Ricky, from back in the day, but it's definitely OG Chippendales, which you don't see too much Chippendale stuff lying around. That shirt, though. I just saw that, I just saw that fire, right? <sighs> you son of a gun. <laughs> Dang. I've never seen all of us care less about each other than when we see VHS. Everyone just ran. Got one. Hey, literally, Ricky, is that a horror VHS? <laughs> this, this is, is horror. horror. Look at this. You got this old Super Nintendo bootleg controller with just some PNGs of Captain Falcon and Baby Bowser, but also right here, five bucks. 
I'm gonna have to do it. I need a favor from you. I need you to let me buy one of your VHS tapes, a horror one, and I'll give it to you after. Thanks, man. <laughs> That's cheating. I could have won. No, 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 Looks no, like no. I just won the challenge. All right, how much for all these? <laughs> how much? Um, 11 bucks. Okay, cool. Would you take 10? Okay, cool. All righty. <laughs> Roscoe and Ricky, I have bad news. I officially won by buying Blake's tape for him. Uh, hey do you guys see it? Do you guys witness it? Remember the comments last time? Like, man, Ricky really is a sore loser. No. Look, you guys, I told you. I was smart. Doing a good deed, buying it for him, made me a winner. You're about to be um, very excited right now, Blake. This one you just found, I'll tell you in a second. I'm not even gonna tell you right now, because I don't want to ruin it for you. What they don't know over there is I'm not counting that as a win. I'm just doing it to kind of push their buttons. I'm totally not counting it as a win. I bought Blake's, is it cheating? Yes, even though I did buy it for him. And now I will officially win properly by buying a horror VHS myself. Here you go, sir. I only have a, a five, sorry, a fiver. No, no, no one dollar to me? Uh, I don't have any no. more. <laughs> Thank you, sir. The most unclimactic victory because they were genuinely bummed that I was cheating, but I knew I wasn't gonna cheat, but it's okay, I win. <laughs> what are you doing right now, dude? There's the action. What are you doing? Are you blowing up a Powerpuff girl right now? Oh, it's got a hole. Oh, uh, she whistles. All right, what I didn't even say at the booth, and Blake didn't even necessarily know either, but he got a bunch of good VHS, but there was one in particular that I knew that Blake had no idea, and that's RTD Presents Operation Blue Line. Looks cool, looks different, right? You know, all the classic things you can say, looks cool. But our friend just got done telling us, and I mean today, this morning, just told us that he has current offers at $460 for one of these. And some of the sealed copies are still going. Yeah, I know some people still are collecting VHS, some aren't, but for over $1,000 in some of the other copies. So he has 460 bucks bids on that right now. So Blake, let's go. Uh, not bad for a dollar. Yeah, good, good haul, yeah. I was so tempted, man. I was like, should, should I tell him? <laughs> should I make up a childhood story to say that I want it? So you could steal it I away know. from me? I didn't, because I'm a Toys R Us kid. I'm a Toys R Us kid. I don't want to grow up, I'm a Toys R Us kid. Ricky just bought this Pokemon right here. Look at that, it's a little tiger, tiger handheld Pokemon keychain. It's like everything, you bought the Powerpuff Girl. Ricky, why did you buy the Powerpuff Girl? Explain to me. So, where are you gonna put this, L I really? Already, I had already blown it up and uh, the only thing you blew, only is, you, you blew it by buying this. The back of Ricky's VHS tape is our motto. We make collectability a way of life. <laughs> Ricky just bought the hypest jacket. How much you get it for? Five bucks. Five bucks, that is sick. Embroidered 50th, what is this, the Rose Parade? Yeah. That's really cool. That's Honestly, really cool. I actually really like that. But Ricky, you know the rule, you don't get to keep it unless you make it in here for sure. Back up further, you're way too close. I don't get to keep it at all. Uh-uh, I get it, straight up. And you have to buy me, You since you guys lost the challenge, you have to be five bucks too. Wait, you never do that. Go ahead, <laughs> shoot it. Wow. Nice. Hey, you guys never responded. How do you feel to your guys' loss today? Not good, dude. I still want to complete it. That's what it's, I'm actually okay now. I'm kind of glad it's over because I was like, I was focusing too much on trying to find certain things and I missed a bunch of stuff. There's excuse maker, Ricky. But I, I'm glad he won because that was a true win right there. Shut up. <laughs> this is Ricky every time we get a tip or a lead that there's good deals down there. He's sick, Roscoe. He's sick in the head. Will they fit a new segment? I have a feeling you don't want to try it right I don't here. want to try it. <laughs> that segment, and that was, will that was they awesome. fit? They're gonna fit. Just looking through a big thing of VHS, I'm gonna grab them, two for five. Iron Giant, Scooby-Doo Great Mysteries, Casper's Haunted Christmas, Semi-Seal, this is the coolest one, and then you you always, you can't leave E.T. behind, that's just messed up. <laughs> Ricky asked if he can drift it, can he? Wow, it actually drifts really good, Ricky. <laughs> Wow. All right, end of the day, ton of freaking stuff. I did win the challenge, which I'm feeling good about. Tons of VHS, cool stuff, Disney stuff, Mario stuff, Wii stuff, tons of Halo figures, DS games, up the yin yang, little schnickel schnickel. Ooh, vintage Rams, I didn't even see that. What else is in here? There was some other stuff in here. Uh, tons of other stuff that we're not even showing right now. Today's lesson, 
broaden your horizons of what you know about and collect. Because today we found some things that we didn't know were valuable, even when finding them, like those Bible Man figures. Like that VHS that Blake ended up finding. We just found out right before that it was worth so much money. So broaden your horizons. And now Ricky, give him a reel for my son. For my son. For my son.